Hey, what's up, guys? This is Aremo from WebBuzz, and in this video, I'll be showing you how you can log into your custom email address hosted on CPanel, popularly known as Webmail, from your phone. The app I'll be using in this tutorial is Gmail, which comes installed with almost every Android phone. And if you are using an iPhone and you would like to use iMail, you can follow the same procedure. The reason I decided to create this video is because I have to do this every single time I'm adding up projects to clients and also when new members join us here at WebBoss. Talking about WebBoss, we make web development relatable, fun and easy. To get updated on future videos, please don't forget to subscribe. The subscribe button is the red button you see below this video. Like, share and of course drop your comments in the comment section. Now let's get to it. Open up the menu of your phone and search for Gmail app or click on the Gmail app in the menu here. On the top right corner, click on your profile icon. You would see the list of email accounts that are currently linked with your Gmail. Simply click on add another account. Select order and type in the email address. In this case, hello at webboss.com.nu Kindly note that this will be something like hello at your domain name.com or hello at your domain name.com.ng whatever the case is. Click on next and select either personal POP3 or personal IMAP. Personally, I prefer to use personal IMAP, no pun intended. Then the password, I'll come here and paste, then next. For the incoming server settings, ensure that the server is set to mail.yourdomainname.extension. In this case, mail.webboss.com.ng. Click on next. Ensure that your outgoing server settings matches your in incoming server settings. That means mail.webboss.com.ng for the SMTP server settings. Click on next. Account options, you can leave this as default or modify as you want, but I will just let that pass and click on next. Your name, I'll say web web boss. Of course, you should put in your name here. And if something like this happens, whereby the setup screen simply closes, sometimes the Gmail app would close in entirety. What you can do is simply come over here, click on the profile icon on the top right, and you would see your email now connected. Email is connected. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions or comments, please kindly drop them in the comment section. Do not forget to subscribe and check out any video that YouTube will be suggesting to you. Love ya!